This is what part of Interstate 70 looked like exactly two weeks ago. A water main break flooded the highway, stranding motorists who needed to be rescued. News 4's Jenna Ray talked to one woman whose car was totaled and a St. Louis couple who just gave her the surprise of a lifetime. It's a story you'll see only on 4. Well, I had just came from picking up my um, nephew and my niece, and we were on our way home. As we got closer, it was just like a lot of lights. I couldn't really see past the 18 wheelers that were in front of me. You see all the water, and it's starting to come across, and I'm like, maybe I should have stopped. But it was kind of too late. Once I got in the water, it was like my car just shut off on me. I'm screaming. The kids are screaming. I was thinking about, like, are we going to drown or not? The inside is all the water damage. The, I don't even know where that part of the car came from. The glove compartment has water damage in it. Like, everything is just total. But my wife saw it, and uh, she had a little compassion for you and wanted to help you out. And she asked me, would I be willing to give you a car? Because I say a car is kind of part time. Y'all going to make me cry. So we're going to give you that uh, towel. Y'all got me crying. <laughs> And I needed a bigger truck, too. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> but I just been so weary that I didn't know what I was going to do, honestly. <laughs> oh, my God. I pray a lot. And it was just like God just answered a prayer. Just to know that there are people out there that are willing to help those that are less fortunate than themselves. I'm like family oriented. I already got, I always have my nieces, my nephews, my sisters, so. But this right here is showing and proving that it's still great people out here that are willing to help other people in need or willing to help somebody who doesn't have anything. And I, oh my God, I just don't know how to thank him enough. I don't know how I can ever thank anybody enough. Cause I was just so, I've been sitting in the house for days and I'm just like, oh, normally I'd be gone somewhere or going to visit somebody. And now I can't go visit somebody or go somewhere. <laughs> Incredible generosity and an incredible story. News Horse Jenna Ray has kept in touch with that woman and was able to connect her with the couple this afternoon. She says she's still waiting on the city of St. Louis to reimburse her for damages from that evening.